Hi there, it's me again, Carcan. Uh, today I'm coming to you with a video, really simple video, simple uh, issue, and it's going to be a really quick video. Uh, the issue is uh, sometimes when I close the lid on my laptop and put it to suspend or sleep or something, uh, and then when I wake it up by opening the lid, the, the keyboard, the trackpad are unresponsive, and I can't do anything except just the touch screen, and I use it to log in and then reboot, and that fixes it. But here's a simple fix for it. After digging a online a lot, I found a really simple solution. And it's just going into Grub, uh, Grub config uh, settings and just change uh, one line and update the Grub and that's it. it this could be done uh, through two methods, either via the terminal or uh, just through Nautilus itself. But we have to open uh, Nautilus as root. So to do that, we need to do sudo nautilus and for the newbies out there don't be scared the terminal is not going to bite it's really just just two words press enter password and then nautilus will open and then now you go to other locations and then you go to computer and then you go to etsy or etc and then you go to default that's where grub is Grub, and that is the bad guy right here. Line number 11. This guy normally comes just grub underscore uh, cmd line underscore linux equals to just quotation mark. It does not come with this line. I don't know exactly what it is, but I know the Nuevo is an open source something NVIDIA. I'm not sure. I don't want to be, you know, I don't want to give you some false information, but that's what I found out and that's what, it, what fixes it for me. Um, I think the kernel checks for Nuevo or something and we, you're running uh, NVIDIA uh, and then it just freezes. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Just put that comment in the comment section to correct me if I'm wrong. But anyway, all you need to do is add this line in between these quotation marks hit save and then exit out of these two go back to your terminal control c and just sudo update grub and that's it after this finishes just reboot your computer go back and test it out i haven't had this issue for a while now if you uh do it and want to see if it worked please just test it out for a couple of days and let me know come back here and let me know if it worked or not otherwise if you have any question or anything else or any other ideas please leave them in the comment section and i will do my best to make a video out of them uh, otherwise i'll see you in the next one thank you